Good news, you guys. We're all saved from the catastrophic downturn in Alberta's economy. Or at least that's what Rachel Notley would have us all believe. What's her big plan? Well, she has appointed NDP MLA Darren Billis to diversify the economy and build market access for Alberta's exports. Thursday, Notley announced a cabinet shuffle among her ministers that have really done little else than campaign for their federal NDP friends. As a part of that shuffle, Notley created a new Ministry of Economic Development and Trade. Part of the job of the new ministry is, and I'm quoting from the press release, support private sector job creation by promoting trade and international agreements. Sounds good, right? Sounds hopeful, right? Wrong and wrong. Now, why do I say that? Well, I say that because I decided to learn more about Darren Billis. He's a teacher by trade, not that there's anything wrong with that, but this seems like sort of the portfolio that requires someone from the private sector or with any private sector experience. But what does Darren know about our economy? Well, let's hear it from Darren himself, here. If we slow down the tar sands, take that money, invest it in the long term, invest it into alternative forms of energy, we're creating jobs, we're protecting our environment. He wants to slow down the tar sands because that will create jobs. Well, I'm sure the approximately 1,000 Albertans who are losing their energy sector jobs every single week because of a slowdown in oil and gas will dispute this as good economic practice. Here, Darren talks about royalties and the environment. We, first of all, got uh, a fair share in our royalties, we'd be able to use those funds in order to invest um, in renewable sustainable technologies, in green energy. We're also calling for a slowdown of the, uh, the current uh, rate that we are pulling out our resources. Man, he sure wants to pump the brakes on the oil sands. And raising royalties is a really, really good way to do that. And we're in the midst of a review right now. That's pretty convenient. And what does Darren say about jump-starting the economy? Listen, no new projects. Don't worry, unemployed oil patch friends. If your rig isn't drilling, you can all be nipple greasers in the mighty wind turbine farms in the Alberta stand of the future. The NDP talent pool is shallow. I never expect much from their appointments and their ministries. I never have, I never will, but they aren't even pretending anymore. Darren Billis hates the oil sands. He wants no new projects. He resents the industry that made our economy boom. Now he's the man in charge of jump-starting the economy. Do you think he will? I don't. For the Rebel.media, I'm Sheila Gunn-Reed.